for allowing me to speak tonight. I uh, live at 2070 Southwest, uh, actually I live at 460 Southwest Riverland Court in Fort White. Um, I recognize, of course, I've been here many, many times in the past four years. I recognize I'm not one of your county uh, citizens, but I am a downstream riparian owner on the Santa Fe River. And your water is my water, especially coming out of Alligator Lake, coming out of Lake Samson, Alligator Lake, down through the New River into the Santa Fe River. So uh, I've, I've heard incredible testimony tonight. Um, we have a tough decision to make in front of you. The thing I have not heard that I can only lend to is I hear about the corporations and I hear about the people, but I haven't heard about a right of nature. Right of nature is something we're working on over in Alachua County. I live in Columbia County, but I work over there in Alachua County too. I work in all of the counties in North Florida because your water is my water. And so using the precautionary principle, using the, the, the thing that makes you make the best choices and decisions is where you're at at this moment. And at this moment, tabling it, dealing with the violations, trying to get the bond money set up where when the impacts do happen because of the type of nature of this type of mining business, that you know your citizens are protected. I'm kind of concerned hearing about all the health issues that I've heard, um, wondering about whether or not these types of corporations cause harm to our neighborhoods. We see this all over the place. We see cancer clusters all over. We see that up in, in Hamilton County. We see it down in the Mosaic area. We see it where mining takes place. And knowing that only two to three percent or whatever that number was, such a small amount of material is mined and changed, changed the land, changed nature forever. The reclamation that happens never goes back to the way nature intended it, never goes back to the way God intended it. And so we're seeing changes to our world because of these types of businesses. So it's just, again, something we need to consider in terms of precautionary principle. Thank you.